everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Um, I am today going to do a um, update number three on my Bye Bye Use Up Products for 2016. This is a collab and I have done two other updates and my original video. I will link them down below and of course everyone else that is participating in, in this year collab slash Use Up Products for 2016. Um, I don't do a lot of product pans, but I was determined to do at least one this year for a whole year. I have some products. I have decluttered some things from previous videos, or I have used them up, or I've decided I don't really like them. So I have my bucket here of things that I am working on, things I have finished, or things that I've decided I don't really like. There are a few things that I have finished. Um, I did finish up one of my Urban Decay um, primer potions. I finished this one up. I have several more to go through, but that was one of the smaller ones that I had. And then I also finished up one of the Shella Ivory Lace Highlighters. Um, I did have some left in this, but it uh, fell out, so I mean, I can't use something that fell out. I don't even know where it fell. It was very little left in there, so I am finished with that. And then I did finish... Oh, that's what it is. This throwing things. Um, this Artisan in uh, foundation, I did have it in my project pan. There isn't much left, but I cannot get any more to come out, and also it is kind of dark for my skin, so this will be going out of my collection. Um, so moving on to the progress that I have been working on, I did in my last update include this palette. I have made quite a bit of progress on two of the shadows. Um, the silver one has uh, is gone. It just kind of just fell out and just broke apart. Um, this is baked here. I don't know if you can see that, but that, that is pan. I've hit pan on that eyeshadow. And then this is sin here, and I had hit pan on it before, but um, that is what is left. And then I have these three shades here, Woodstock, um, Psychedelic Sister, and then Flipside, which I'll be working on um, in next month. My Goal is at least hit pan on this shadow because I love it so much. And then I love this shade, so I'm going to work on hitting pan on one of these shades of the brighter colors. It's harder for me to use those colors because that's not something I wear all the time. Um, but I am determined to use up this palette this year because it is one of my older palettes. I currently still have um, several um, eye potion, eye pr uh, primers. So I currently don't need any more. Um, I am working on these I'm putting to the side right now, which is the Little Rock and the Elizabeth Mott, because um, I am trying to finish up all the little small Urban Decay ones. So this is the one I'm working on. Um, it's still full because it takes forever to go through. Um, I have the original full size. Um, I only have about this much, but I don't use this one as much because I'm trying to work through this one. So that's my goal is to hopefully finish this by this month or the next update um, and hopefully I'll lessen my um, primer potions that's why or eye primers that's why I don't have any new ones in my collection because I'm trying to finish these and then I am currently basically the same with the Becca Opal I thought I would be finished this with this by now but product still keeps coming out it's really hard to tell where I'm at um, there is a gap here but um, it still has products, so I'm still working on that. Um, I do have my Vincent Longo blush. I love this blush. Um, the, if you can tell how much is showing, I have been really using this uh, quite frequently every day when I wear makeup. Um, and I just, I'm going to be sad when this is gone. I did, you know, want to put it in my project pan and use it up. Um, it is a more uh, expensive product, and it's more of a blush topper. The only downside is that it is very... Um, pigment or powdery so it does kind of loosen the product up and it goes faster than what I would probably go through a normal blush but that's okay um I still enjoy the product um I am currently I use some of these shadows in my elf um I took out the plastic thing so it's now just um I have kind of used up some of this one here and a little bit of this one but they're still pretty much the same I don't use those all the time so and then uh, my Urban Decay lipstick, which I was been working on, the naked one, I'm pretty much the same. I don't wear this all the time, and it's one of my favorite lipsticks. I try to use it um, almost every other time. It just takes a lot. I mean, golly, it's a little tiny one. It takes forever to use. Um, 
This is my Milani blush that I did add. Um, this is Blossom Time Rose. I basically have just um, used up a little bit, you, and the rose looks like it's faded a little bit, but really, I'll probably have that forever. Oh, another one I'm really proud of. The Becca Opal, the mini one, I've been working... Woo! It's off. Um, I've actually hit pan on it. I don't know if you can see that, but I've hit pan on this little sampler um, of this. I love it. Um, I don't know if I'll repurchase it once I run out. We will see, but I do love it. This is the progress I have on the other um, Shella, Shella Ivory Ice. Oh my gosh, I can't remember what this thing's called. Um, Ivory Lace Highlighter from Shella. This is what I have left. Believe me, I'm going to have a silent funeral for this because I do love this and I don't know if I will repurchase it. The single eyeshadow that I was working on in Bella Champagne. This is pretty much the same. I haven't been using this as much because I've been focusing on my palette. So I really need to pull this out and start using it more. And then I did include my Tarte Bronzer, which I haven't even been using this. I need to. I've already hit pan on it, so I really would like to finish this by the end of the year because this is pretty old. And another thing is I already have hit pan on it, so I should have used this up by now. And then I am adding the Better Skin um, Superstay Maybelline Masca uh, Mascara. Um, concealer. I would like to use this up. I do like this. It's a really great concealer, but um, I would like to use it up. I'm still pretty much the same with this blush because I've been working on my Vincent Longo blush. Um, once I finish that one, I probably will move on to this one or try to at least wear them at the same time. Uh, this is the concealer that I was wanting to work on, the Benefit Boy and um, Brightener. I'm still pretty much the same. On that, um, I did use up the other box and lipstick. It kind of fell out, but this is pretty much the progress for this box and lipstick. And then the NARS is pretty much the same. Um, I really tried to use up at least one product for my lips, and I haven't actually um, done that. This is the progress on the Tristique lip crayon. Um, I did put my brow pencils back in here because I was products I was trying to use up. Um, this is what I have left the It Cosmetic. I have used this, so a little bit has been used up. A little less than la last time. Um, I do like this. And then the next one, I don't... Once I finish the It Cosmetics, I will just put this back in my routine. That's what I have. Um, I should be able to finish it by the end of this year because I'm really going to focus... I'll maybe using my pencils instead of my e.l.f. brow gel, which I really like. Still the same with the NUX cleanser. I'm definitely going to put this in my in my shower. I said that I would do that last time and I forgot. This is the Maybelline Taupe. Uh, is it? No, this is Vintage Plum. I still the same. I haven't been using this. I'm going to do a look with it that, this week so I can um, use it up. This is the e.l.f. Poor Professional or the Poor Professional License to Blot. Um, I haven't even touched this. This is what's left or what's in there. Um, I have been using a different pore filler, but I need to, to use that. I am going to be adding the, since I did use up the Nick um, Rimmel Stay Matte Powder, I'm going to add the NYX uh, Stay All Day, or Stay Matte but Not Flat Powder. I'm going to add that instead of using my Rimmel because I would like to use that up and get it out of my collection. Not that it isn't a good powder, but partially the problem I don't like is that it doesn't close very good, so that's what bothers me. I am adding the Hourglass Primer. I love this, the... Um, Veil Primer, Mental Primer. I do like this. Um, Celestial sent it to me, Beauty on here, and, and I'm actually liking it, but I am trying to, I want to add a primer to my, um, you know, use up for 2016. And then I also wanted to add a cream um, product, and I really like this product, So and I've already kind of hit bottom on it, so I wanted to kind of finish this up, since I did finish up the other one in my last project pan, or last update. And this one is in, I actually don't know what this is. It's a e.l.f. long-lasting lustrous eyeshadow, but I don't know the shade. It's like a purple pink shade. It's really pretty. I love it. And so that's pretty much my progress. I'm really trying. Um, it's hard to, I think I, when I started this project pan, 
I had in my mind that I would finish up stuff quickly and really you do and you don't. If you don't focus on those products and you have more products than you need, um, then you end up, you know, forgetting about them. And so that's why I do these updates too, because then it reminds me, oh my gosh, I haven't touched that product in three weeks, four weeks. I need to focus on it. And I've really been trying. I mean, if you saw some of the progress, I have finished up some stuff. And like I said, you know, the Vincent Longo blush, because I love it so much, I have used up quite a bit of product. So I really appreciate everybody, all the support I've gotten, all the new subscribers. I really do. I can't uh, express how much it means to me that you're subscribed to my channel and you're watching my videos and just everything. I really appreciate it. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.